Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. For today's video I'm doing a quick honest kind of opinion update for you guys because I've noticed over the past two years of me owning my Teddy Blake bags which I was unfortunately kindly provided in collaboration with them. I have noticed every time I show one of the bags on my Instagram or whenever it gets mentioned in one of my vlogs, you guys always want an update from me. And I've kind of just pushed it aside for the past two years, but I decided that I'm gonna do an update for you guys because there is seriously a stark difference between when I use each bag and how much I actually like them. So I'm gonna be doing a quick little video for you guys with my 100% honest opinion on how much I actually like my Teddy Blake bags. Ugh, my hair is stuck to my lips. So the first bag I'm gonna be talking about right off the bat is the one that I first got from them two years ago in Japan. And that is this one right here, which you guys absolutely loved back when I was living in Japan. I showcased this bag a lot in my travel vlogs when I was actually going to airports or when I was going out and needed to carry a lot of stuff. Now with that in mind, that literally is the only time I actually use this bag. I never use it just because for me over the years, I find I don't want to use large bags. Like I just don't really need them, especially in the kind of field of work that I do. There really is nothing heavy or huge that I need to bring with me out on a daily basis. So I'm gonna honestly tell you guys right now, I literally only use this bag when I'm going to the airport. And there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. It just so happened that this bag was the perfect size to carry carry on stuff and still be able to get away with it as a personal bag or luggage. So I have used this to carry all my cameras and all my electronics whenever I'm moving abroad, overseas, or just things that I was unable to fit in my carry-on bag, I was able to sneak into this. The second bag I got from Teddy Blake is one that I actually got quite recently from them. It was back in February that I got this bag here and the reason I got this one is because it better suits me and you can tell just by the size comparison to the previous bag this is something I literally use on a daily basis. I take it everywhere with me. It has become my daily bag but this just pairs perfectly with every outfit. It carries exactly what I need. A lip gloss, car keys, my wallet, and my phone and that's pretty much it. I really don't bring anything else with me when I'm on the go. And because I no longer do daily vlogging, I only do monthly vlogs, I find I don't need to carry cameras around with me anymore. And on days that I do, I just usually swap out this bag for something a little bit bigger to fit my vlogging camera in. But otherwise, if I'm just going out casually on a normal day, I don't really need anything else. And this bag is perfect for a girl who really just brings the bare minimum with them. And it's super high quality. I always get compliments on it. People always wanna know where it's from. So I definitely think it's worth the buck for this. And this seriously has become my everyday go to purse. Anyways, that's my honest opinion. As you can see, there's really a stark difference between the two bags and how often I use them. I do, however, highly recommend them because they're really high quality. Like I've gotten so many compliments each time I bring that bag. And even at airports, I always get eyed with my big bag. People are always like, damn, because I think you guys think it looks like a fake Birkin which I didn't realize because I've never been a luxury brand kind of girl. So I had no idea that's what it looked like until you guys pointed it out two years ago when I first got it. So yeah, anyway, I hope you guys like this quick little honest opinion kind of update video on my Teddy Blake bags. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to thumbs up if you did. Check them out in the description box down below if you are curious on any of the bags and want to get one for yourself. Remember to subscribe to see more and I'll see you next time. Bye!